Hey everybody, my name is Eples Vox, and I just got out of bed, and I am a really congested and feeling really sleepy, but that's not going to stop me from bringing you all the latest and greatest in Pokemon news. Now, we've got a lot. There's new Korokoro Cora scans available, and we have a ton of information being brought out to it. Mega Garchomp. We've got picture, picture Mega Garchomp, and Mega Garchomp is going to exist. We've got Mega Mewtwo X. Apparently, the previous Mega Mewtwo we have seen was Mega Mewtwo Y, and it's exclusive to Pokemon Y, and evolves with Mega Mewtwo Knight Y. And this one is Psychic and Fighting type, and it's Mega Mewtwo X, and it's exclusive to Pokemon X, and evolves with Mega Mewtwo, Mewtwo Knight X. The I the knights get a little confusing, but and it's going to be um, Psychic and Fighting. And it knows the ability Steadfast, I believe. We've got the second form of evolution of the starters for the new Kalos region. And um, Chespi's ev Chespin's evolution is Haribugu. Obviously, these are the Japanese games and names that will change when they release the trailer, probably tomorrow with the English names. But Haribugu is Chespin's evolution. It's pure grass type. It knows the move Mudshot. Finnekin's evolution is... Tiruna, Tiruna, which is pure fire type, and it knows the move Psycho Cut. And for Roki's evolution is Giro Gashira, which is pure water type and knows bounce. So there's no fire fighting, there's no fire psychic. Everything is pure fire, water, grass. Which is kind of interesting since they're moving to a lot of different type combinations. Not entirely sure what's up with that. Um, we've got... Oh yeah, we've got some. We've got new fossil Pokemon. I haven't seen a whole lot of that since the older games, but we have two new fossil Pokemon. One is a rock, rock and dragon type T Rex, um, which is named Chigo, Chigurisu. Again, I can't do the Japanese names, but Chigurisu, which has the ability Hard Jaw, which increases the attack power of Bite type moves like Bite and Crunch and things like that interesting move, uh, or interesting ability. And then we know Amar Amarusu, which is a rock and ice Diplodocus. I don't know what that means. It's a rock and ice, you know, dinosaur, basically, which has the move Free Skin, which makes all of their normal attacks ice attack, or ice type, which is pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot better than the hard job, but that is pretty cool. Uh, and then we got, then we got a white, we got a dog and a cat. <laughs> Don't know why, but oh, um, normal white dog named Tor, Tor, Torimian, which has the new ability Pure Coat, which, uh, what does it do? Reduces physical damage, and you can customize its appearance apparently. And then you have a psychic type cat called Nyanonikusu, which. Almost has Nyan in it, so I swear if they call it Nyan Cat, I will rage. Which has different male and female appearances. Male is on the right, female is on the left in the picture. And its move pool varies by its gender, which is kind of interesting also. Um, male is more of a supporter, while the female is more of an attacker. Um, female knows extrasensory, and male knows a miracle eye. It has keen eye or infiltrator as the ability. There's also a new fairy, you know, type chart to show what it, you know, what does what with when it comes to fairy. Fairy is super effective to fighting, dark, and dragon type. It's not very effective to fire, poison, or steel type. And then apparently steel is no longer, um, resistant, or is no longer, um, uh, it's no longer super, like, the ah, words are hard, I just woke up. Okay, Steel has lost its resistance to Dark and Ghost. That was what I was trying to say. Back to Fairy. Fairy resists fighting Dark and Bug. Kind of interesting. And it's immune to Dragon type, obviously. Uh, there's a new anime character called Karina, which is someone also in the game that you can battle. She's an actress. Um... You can change your hair and clothes at the boutique and salon, reflected in the graphics. Um, oh, that's where the actress is reflected. Team Flare has five scientists. Uh, 
Kusiro Shiki, Morniji, Bara, Akabi, Korea. Obviously, those will change. And Team Flare's goal is to make the world a beautiful place. And yeah, that's about it. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Lots of crazy information. Mega Mewtwo X will certainly be an interesting Pokemon. I, I want to see how that in is involved. I want to see if that's in the Genesect movie, since it only showed Mewtwo Y. Um, it'll be kind of interesting to see how Mewtwo er, Psychic and Fighting go together. And then Mega Garchomp obviously is going to be uber badass. And hopefully we'll get the third form evolutions of the starters soon. Thank you for watching, guys. Sorry this was kind of a mess. I just woke up and I'm blah. But I hope you enjoyed nonetheless, and I will talk to you guys next time. Let me know what you think about Mewtwo X and Y in the comment section below. Bye bye